<laughs> oh man, you were so weak. Let's play a game, shall we? Hey everybody, welcome back to Doom. Today's episode is a little wad called Earth. This is actually a very old wad. In fact, it's old enough that it's vanilla compatible. That being said, the kind of things that this guy managed to fake is pretty impressive, you gotta admit. I mean, look at that. It looks like an actual reflection, and then you can see oceans, ocean waves crashing up against the shore. Obviously, that's done with animated textures, and there are a lot of lines there, but it still looks really good, all things considered. I mean, for its time, you probably wouldn't have... Nobody probably would have thought that, that such a thing could happen. You know, especially on the Vanilla Doom engine. It looks really good. But anyway, enough gushing. It's time to start playing. Nobody plays Doom to just gush over the graphics. I mean, come on. They play Doom to play it. Nice pillars, too. Check that out. It's a very visually pleasing kind of thing. Ooh, and clearly it does not skip on difficulty, either. Look at all those enemies there. Yeesh. I think, I, I think I'm pretty sure there's also a chain gunner. Oh, crap. What the hell? Why is there a Baron back there? That's weird. That's just weird. Oh, see ya, pal. I would say parting is such sweet sorrow, but let's face it, your parting is a gift from above. There you go. Oh, there's the chain gunner in question. Take that! You know what? Screw it. I'm just gonna let you get chewed out a bit. There you go. Take that. Ha 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 ha! You're just gonna kill all your friends, aren't you? There's a special place in hell for you! Although you're a demon, so you would probably enjoy it, wouldn't you? Oh, look at that! Isn't that nice? I think I found a secret! Hell? Okay. What's going on here? I can't see. Freaking darkness. Hello, darkness, my old friend. I've come to talk with you again. From the vision softly creeping. Oh, I see. Cool. Awesome. Well, at least now I've got the regular shotgun for... More distant enemies, and the chain gun! Even better for distant enemies! Everything's coming at me right now! Yep, I figured there'd be a way you'd get behind that Baron in the beginning. That'd be weird if there wasn't some kind of way past it. You can't see a damn thing. And unfortunately, the hallways are not getting any lighter. As I kind of hoped they would. Oh well. I guess I'll have to go some other way. Clearly that leads nowhere. Oh, okay. What the? Okie dokie then. Where the hell am I supposed to go? I mean, there's a, there's a red key up there, but how I would actually, oh, okay. <laughs> Duh, you gotta look. Actually gotta look around every once in a while. It's good for you. Actually paying the slightest amount of attention. Oh, that's cool. You know, despite being made on Vanilla Doom, it's got a very nice look to it. What the hell? How did you guys get out and come here? How did you guys factor into this? How are you guys able to get active? Is there some kind of hole in the wall that allowed you to hear me? Cause there's no way you would be able to see me from that. Oh, I don't remember this. I remember playing this wad before, but I guess I didn't play this far. Or I just straight up forgot this part. Oh, nice! It even has a deep water effect. For those of you who do not know, basically what it does is it has the edge with the texture on it, but then over this far, it doesn't have the lower walls textured. I know, that's probably a lot to take in, but... 
Okay, basically, the wall goes down, the floor goes downward here. I I'll explain once I kill these jackasses. There we go. Okay, good. Anyway, what's actually going on here is... Okay, I can't, I can't crouch down enough to... Okay, now I can. Yeah, see? You notice that there's nothing here. There's nothing down here. That's because there's no, there's no textures that were given to this. Specifically. Ah, damn. Oh crap! They cause they cause you damage once it runs out of radiation suits. Damn it! Dingus! Damn it! Oh, okay. Damn! It. Come on! Man, it made me panic there. Anyway, yeah, that's a lowered floor, and on the sides, and uh, I guess the floor of that too. There are no textures there, so the way Doom compensates for that is it stretches the texture of the floor around it. The way it handles flats is that it stretches textures out. That, that's how you know, if you noticed uh, in Vanilla Doom, if you no-clipped out, you would see the floors just stretch on forever in the void space. That's because that's how Doom works. When there's no flats to specifically to tell it to stop here, then it will just keep stretching onward. And that's the case there. Because there's no walls there, because there's no floor texture, it just continues with that floor texture. But of course, there's no collision, so you'll just sink through the floor, kinda. To where the floor actually is. If that makes any sense. I don't have time to draw out a diagram, so you'll just have to take my word for it. But it is a nice effect. It was used in an official WAD, I, I think it was in TNT Evolution, yeah. Yeah, it was in the second level, if I remember correctly. That water... That... Put, puddle of water. Ah, shit. I knew I saved for a good reason. Come on, you bastard. Oh, crap. Pain Elementals, too. Pain in my freaking mental. Pain in my element. Take this. Go to hell. Bastard. Jackass. I'll kill all of you. Especially you. Big loaf. Come on! That's right, that's what I freaking thought. Here we go. That's two of them down. Unfortunately, I'm about to run out of ammo. Not good. I guess I should just take the key and run. Take the money and run. Just gotta take the money and run. Not good. Not freaking good, man. Crap. Dang it. I'm I'm boned, aren't I? Not really. I can still do this. Damn it. Ah, screw it, I'm getting the ammo. Bastard. Yeah, go ahead and infight, why don't you? Take that. That's what you get. You piece of crap. Getting very paranoid about this. Haha. <laughs> that was hilarious. Ooh. A secret, I guess. Also, that's pretty cool. I'm pretty sure what happened is that person used a custom texture on the wall there to make it look like it's all cracked, and then obviously there's a brightness set to zero so that you can't see inside it. Because this is hollow inside. You can sort of tell. But it's very clever the way it's handled. Oh boy. Haha! <laughs> Take that, you prick. You suck. You sack. Take this. There you go. Damn it. Too far away to do any of substantial damage to him. I get the feeling once I get any closer. Oh, okay. Well, good thing he just randomly decided to walk away from me. That makes things much better. Much simpler. 
I get the feel. Why do I get the feeling there's only one level here? Oh, holy crap! Okay, let's see. Oh, oh, nice. There's more than one level. Wow, I really need to have played this before. Man, I've been missing out. I knew about the, I knew about the beginning area and even the pillars, but I don't remember all this. Have I been missing out? Well, I guess from here on in, it's, it's new. That's awesome. I'm, I'm totally fine with that. The tomb. Gotta love the music too. That is so vintage doom. Oh, okay. Wait, what? Oh, okay, that's cool. Nice. I don't know if that did, but maybe it did something good for me. There's an arrow pointing in that direction. Well, that would explain it, wouldn't it? <laughs> okay, then. That's cool. Just give me a lot of crap right from the get-go, huh? That's awesome. Did that do anything else for me? Is there any other area specifically that I can go into? Oh, okay, that was an elevator. Somehow I didn't see it. That's weird. Ah, I guess the effect is that it takes you inside the pyramid. That's awesome. Ooh, look at that. For some reason that part specifically reminded me of Laura Bailey's Doom, except it didn't Except this person didn't charge 20 bucks. Also, the design is actually better. No offense, Lori, but the fact that you charged money for your little wad made it... It was kind of a, a douchey move. Just saying. Ah, it. Well, this isn't good. Dang it. Go to hell, lost souls. There you go. Oh boy. Well, at least the Baron won. He's easier to deal with. Unless I am stupid enough to get myself shot, which I always am. Oh, okay. He was, he was a death story to begin with. Good to know. Screw you. I am going to kick your ass more ways than you can imagine. I have to say, if he can, if he's felled by one rocket blast, it would be the same with the super shotgun blast, wouldn't it? There. Now things are in my favor. For once. Let's just go ahead and open all the doors. Why the hell not? I already screwed myself over, why not? Why not go all the way with this? Let's open all the tombs and just really let loose. Just really make it all the chaos flood in. Okay, everyone's been alerted. That's cool. Come on, Imp Mancubus. Don't tell me you jackasses are suddenly going to be quiet on me. Ooh, look at that. It's a real labyrinth. Take that. Ha. That was easy. That's fun. This is fun. Ooh, look at the shadow effect. I'm pretty sure Jeezy Doom did that because there's no way a mod could do that unless it was some kind of texture, but I seriously doubt that. I'm pretty sure that's Jeezy Doom's doing. But it is a really nice effect regardless. Who cares who did it? It's still awesome to look at, am I right? Oh, look at this. A red key. Isn't that nice? Isn't that just lovely? Is there a red door around here somewhere? I'm sure there is somewhere. Go to hell. You can go to hell too. You can go to hell, and you can go to hell, and you can go, and you can go, and you can go to hell. What the? This is gonna be bad, isn't it? I wasn't paying attention to see if I saved the first time or not, so I had to save again. Because that's how I roll. Oh, okay. If I just stayed on it for a minute, I would have been able to go back. What the hell? Okie dokie then. That's cool. 
Ah, okay, that's that's pretty cool. Just a nice little side area. That gets you stuff. Oh boy. God diggity daffodi oh, okay. I don't know what your story is. Ah, he probably killed the mancubus, didn't he? How much you wanna bet? He killed the mancubus. Thanks, Baron! Your reward will be eternal. Punishment. Ooh, look at that. Nice. Most of these are pretty much optional areas that just get you stuff in the end. That's cool. Although, at least, luckily for me, most of the enemies killed each other. Oh boy. I hope this, uh, this is a mandatory area. Because that would. Because now I'm actually taking some, some good amount of damage here. That would suck if I went through that just to get more crap. Not that I'm not in favor of more crap, but you know, sometimes you gotta know when enough is enough. I'm not that selfish. I'm not so selfish that I'm gonna die for it. That I'm gonna get myself killed over it. Ah, I get it. I think what you gotta do is you gotta stray front. Ah, oh, never mind. Never mind, you can't go over there to begin with. Cool. At least I can shoot this fool. Hello, freak. Why don't you die for me? Thanks, pumpkin. So, that is mandatory, but I need another area. Wouldn't surprise me if that's it, because that's the only place I haven't checked yet. When people say it's the last place you look, what they mean is it's the last place possible to look. You look through literally all other areas before getting to that spot. It's the last place possible to look. It's always in the last place possible. Thanks, Baron! I'm rooting for the Baron, to be honest. Thanks, man. Although, you almost got me, because I was distracted. Too bad you suck. I wasn't going to waste another rocket on his ass. Are you kidding me? I'm pragmatic with that kind of crap. Ooh, nice. Although it is pretty cool. I don't know what that was supposed to be for, considering there are stairs right here. But oh well. I'm sure that was for something. It's probably just for decoration, knowing me. Hmm, the yellow key. Isn't that li lovely and nice? I knew it would be here. There's only, there's no other place it could be. It's like I said, literally the last place possible to look. Oh, look at that! I've got a way out of here! Very nice. Very good indeed. Mmm, health. Oh, thank goodness. What the hell? Ah, oh, crap. Ah, oh, damn. Oh, okay. Yep. <laughs> you kidding me? It's like E1M4. You know, when you get the Soul Sphere. Oh, well, I guess I can take it. I could have just jumped, but... I didn't want to... I didn't want to cheapen it. I only jumped there because, you know, it would have got me up there anyway, and I wanted to be faster about it. I ain't got time to waste. Anybody get time for that? You know what? Screw it. I think I will kill you. Go to hell. Take this. Ooh, that was a close one. I almost blew up my face. My beautiful face. No, don't blow up my face. I'm good. Oh, okay. Oh yeah, this definitely is just a nice and pleasant trip to the key. Nothing to see here. General Arkbar, enemies off the starbound. It's a trap. What? Really? Okay, it's one of those kind of things, isn't it? Maybe I spoke too soon. Okay, now. Enemies off the starbound. It's a trap! What? There are no enemies? Well, I look stupid, don't I? But then again, is there never a point? Is there ever a point where I don't? <laughs> don't answer that. It was a rhetorical question. Hello. 
Lost soul, where the hell you came from? Oh, well, wherever you came from, I really couldn't care less. What? What was the maid givers doing in here? I'm surprised you managed to fit, buddy. That's probably why you couldn't leave. Also because you had to have hit the switch, which you can't do because you're a monster. So suck on it. Suck on it to your grave, man. Mmm. Very nice. Very good indeed. Okay. We're gonna do that again. Ooh, Mines of Moria. That sounds awesome. I can't wait to see what kind of mines will be mine. Okay. I see they're giving me a lot of stuff right from the get-go. What's your angle? What's your angle, man? I know you're up to no good. You're not gonna get me off my guard. In fact, that's gonna make me on high alert. I'm suspicious now. What kind of freaks are you gonna send my way, huh? Nice mines, though. It's kinda cool. Damn. Got hurt a little there, but that's okay. Ooh, very nice. See? You can tell by the, you can tell here that it's it's just a texture. Cam flashlight, what the hell? Really? Man, that's weird. Oh well. Mm. I think our definitions of secret differs a bit. Oh crap. Man, that was close. That was ridiculous. Why would you do that to me, huh? Why? Why would you do that to me? Asshole. I'll show you the what for. Seriously. Did I mention how cool that is? Because that is seriously cool. Look at that. That is cool. Thank goodness this surface doesn't hurt. Take that. Big guy. Big boy. Oh, what a big boy you are. Take that, you prick. Great, more freaking pain elementals. Son of a... Come on! Take that! There you go. Your turn, pal. There you go. Now just die for me, will ya? Die! Do it! Do it, fool! You have no idea what you are doing! I've got three words for you. You die tonight. Lied, you die now. That's how I roll. Deal with it. Ah, I see. No, nobody here but us dead guys. Hey. Kinda weird how this is exempt from the HUD map. I guess that's something this guy did deliberately. I guess that that's kind of cool, I guess. No, it's kind of weird. What's with the floor right here? Is that to support it? Because that's a weird looking support you got there, friend. Oh well, I won't judge. Hey, whatever works, works, right? I don't care if it does look like ass, as long as it works. You gotta be functional rather than aesthetic. I mean, if you have beautiful looking supports, but the mine collapses, well then it, it failed to do its job. It failed to fulfill its one purpose. Who cares? Ooh, nice. Yeah, I'll grab it now, why not? I need to quit being so... I need to quit being so hesitant about these kind of things. Otherwise I'm gonna get myself killed. Ah, there we go. I knew it was possible. But I just had to believe. Or at least believe enough to save and then do it. <laughs> oh, what do we have here? Oh crap. There's an arch file. Where the hell are you? Beasted. Oh, goodbye. Lovely to meet you. Too bad I have to say bye. Oh boy. This looks cool. Not gonna lie, it looks pretty damn cool. Okay. 
was wondering if that was the starting area, but no, it couldn't be. Especially since I don't remember seeing a Mancubus in the beginning. <laughs> oh boy. There you go. Take this. Oh boy. Take this. Take this. Take this. Oh crap. You gotta be careful. Oh boy. Screw this, I'm shooting rockets. Just call me the rocket man. Until now. Okay, now. Take this. Screw you. Screw them. Screw them all. And now die. Oh, did you already die? Well, good. Good, thank you for following instructions. I really appreciate it. Take that, you prick. Damn it. Take this. Ha ha. Although I could have just waited for the Baron to kill you, I guess. Probably didn't think that went out very well, did I? Take this. I may have made it a little easier with mouse aim, but who cares? It's very cheap anyway. Ha 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 ha! Oh man, you were so weak that I finished you off without a snap, without any trouble at all. So take that and suck it. Suck it down. And when you're sucking it down, I hope you're thinking of me. Wink. Oh, okay. Wait a minute. What's down there? Is there anything important down here? Oh, okay. Just a whole lot of nothing. It's just the way I like it. Though there's a soul sphere, so I guess that counts as something, I guess. But is it really worth the return trip? Ah, there we go. Very nice. I went from having more or less half health I wish I had grabbed the med kit first, but whatever. Who cares? It's all about the here and now, man. All about the here and now. Speaking of here and now, I gotta find my way out of here. Here and now. I gotta wait, find my way out of here and now. Oh, that's a good. Oh, that's good. I just struck gold with that, I think. It's all about the here and now, so get me out of here now. Can't believe I thought of that. Oh crap. Damn it. Take this. Screw you. S seriously, screw you. Arsehole. You're gonna pay for that one. With your life. Seriously? What is with that, huh? I guess the same guy who made this made Phobos. That other visually impressive one that also happened to have a damaging floor down there. I guess that's to symbolize that if you fall down the cliff, you're dead, but how, how are you supposed to get out of here then? There's a blue key down here. There's a blue skull, I should say. So clearly this is man. This is quote-unquote mandatory, but how are you supposed to get out of it then? Huh? You tell me. What's the point of there being a blue skull here if the only way out is death? Huh? probably another way out of here. Yep. That's what I figured. Yeah, the only way out here is through a secret. You have to you have to you have to use mandatory secrets because those are always fun, right? Aren't mandatory secrets just the best? I knew you were it. I knew it. I knew you were on the freaking floor. You beasted. Unfortunately, I there's not a lot of time that I have left with this, so Whatever I find next, it's gonna have to be something pretty significant. What the hell? Is that a red door? No, clearly not. Oh, right, it's because that's how I got out. No, it's not. And that was another way out. Right. Or was the way into something? I have, I have no idea. I don't remember a, I don't remember crap, especially when everything looks the same. 
There aren't really many distinguishing landmarks in this place. Sad to say. It also doesn't help that you can't see anything because the hub... The HUD map excludes a lot of this, unfortunately. Let me guess, another mandatory secret, right? Or is there some other way, some other pathway to get up there? Because this is getting confusing and really fast. It looked like it would either go that way or that way or what. Anyway, I guess I'll have to find out next time, if ever. In the meantime, I'm going to end this here for now. So, that is it for now. Thank you so much for tuning in with me. Make sure to spread this video around like mind veins. And I will see you next time. Now go out there and capitalize on life. Peace out, have a good one, and have a nice and pleasant day. If you enjoyed the content and want to stay up to date, I upload 10 a.m. and 2 p.m. Eastern Standard Time every single day. You can also subscribe and hit the bell icon or just check out the end screens right here.